Hey, this is Christian hanging out at the Diesel U Music Suite at Lollapalooza with... Oh, my name is Jamie. And I'm Ian. We're in the Go Team. The Go Team. Now, is this, you, you guys have played Lollapalooza before, yes? Yeah, two years ago, wasn't it? How was the crowd? It was good, man. Yeah, it was like, woo! It was big. How do you think uh, the audiences differ between the UK festivals and the American festivals? <clears throat> I don't know if they do particularly, but I kind of did have perhaps a little bit more whooping and whatnot going on. But um, Americans love a good whoop, really, don't they? I mean, it's the whooping capital of the world, isn't it? Like, what woo. can you? D- <laughs> I was just going to ask you to define whoop. Well, you know, woo, like that. And you guys just put out a record this year on Sub Pop, proof of you. And who who'd you work with on that? Uh, a whole bunch of people actually. There was Chuck D on there and. Um, some double Dutch ladies called the Double Dutch Divas did some singing in New York and um, Solex in Amsterdam and all sorts of people. How did the Chuck D connection happen? Just a dream that came true really. We uh, just sent him an email, sent him some CDs and he liked it, you know. He said, to quote Chuck, we had spirit and, um, you know, he said that he wanted, likes to do things that people don't expect him to do and stuff. So he obviously saw something in us, you know, to do. To, um, and whereabouts in England are you guys based? Brighton. Yeah, there's, there's a couple of, couple of ladies live in London. But uh, that's not that's only about an hour away on the train, so... Right on. And how often do you guys get over to the States? God, man, this must be a couple of times a year, but... Mm. So you don't, you don't mind coming and picking up some, some, free thre- some free threads since you go a while without changing your threads or washing your threads? <laughs> yeah, I mean, we're very un- unhygienic people, generally, <laughs> so... As are most bands playing this festival, I think. I d- I'm, yeah, I, I'm, I just simply don't do laundry. It's not, bores me. Laundry bores How me. long can you go without washing your clothes? Before, well, I, 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 you know, a whole tour. I'm not expecting to do any washing on this tour. And we've got another two weeks to go now. So, um, so you, can, you can get about, what, ten wears into a t-shirt? Well, it depends if it's been worn on stage, because I'm a sweaty man, and Jamie is quite That's sweaty as well. Next level. And, and we, you know, <laughs> the, the go team takes sweat to the next level. <laughs> and it's, you know, we it's our currency. This is what we deal with, you know. So um, yeah, if we don't come, if we come off stage and we're kind of dry in any way, it's a kind of a failed gig, you know. We we come yeah, off we'll stage let, we'll let and we're down if if there's if there's no perspiration. Right. Maybe, so. But you get to wear the t-shirt for another day, if necessary. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and anyone you're looking forward to seeing this weekend? Uh, well, we're hitting the road again, like tonight. But I mean, um, I mean, CSS are playing, but we've been we've been playing with them for the last two nights anyway. So I might have a night off from CSS tonight. But um, Cadence Weapon, he seems quite interesting. Oh. Well, thank you for stopping by. Have a good show. Cheers, man. Cheers. Thank you, the Go Team. Thanks.